The Democrat nominee for president is Hillary Clinton. Who is Hillary Clinton? What are some of her major accomplishments? Hillary Rodham was born on October 26, 1947, in Chicago, Illinois. At the age of three, her family moved to a Chicago suburb, Park Ridge, where she lived throughout her young life. She attended public school and participated in the Girl Scouts. During high school, she wrote for the school newspaper and was active in her school's student council. After graduating high school, she enrolled at Wellesley College, a private women's college in Wellesley, Massachusetts. She majored in political science and graduated with a bachelor's degree in 1969. She became the first woman to speak at a Wellesley College commencement ceremony and received a standing ovation for her efforts. After graduating from Wellesley, she attended Yale Law School, which she graduated from in 1973 with a law degree. While attending Yale, she met Bill Clinton. The two dated for several years and eventually moved to Arkansas, where they were married in 1975. Hillary joined the prestigious Rose Law Firm in 1977 and in 1979 became its first female full partner. Meanwhile, Bill was elected governor of Arkansas in 1978. Bill Clinton served as governor for 11 of the next 13 years. He was defeated for re-election in 1980, but won again in 1982. As First Lady of Arkansas, Clinton continued her practice as a lawyer, but was also appointed chairperson of the Rural Health Advisory Committee. Throughout her legal career, she was a strong advocate of children's rights. She served on the board of directors for the Arkansas Children's Hospital Legal Services and the Children's Defense Fund. Additionally, she served on the board of directors for TCBY, a yogurt company, Lafarge, an industrial company that specializes in concrete, and Walmart. During her time as First Lady of Arkansas, she also gave birth to her and Bill's only child, Chelsea. She was named Arkansas Woman of the Year in 1983 and Arkansas Mother of the Year in 1984. She also worked to establish mandatory teacher testing for the state, as well as creating statewide education curriculum standards and placing limits on classroom sizes. In 1992, Bill Clinton announced he was running for president, and, as a result, Hillary Clinton received national attention for the first time. Throughout his campaign, Bill assured the nation that they would be getting two for the price of one, and openly acknowledged that Hillary would play a significant role in his administration. Hillary Clinton became First Lady of the United States in 1993, after Bill won the presidency. During her years as First Lady, she became more actively involved in her husband's administration than any First Lady since Eleanor Roosevelt. She was also the first First Lady to have an office in the West Wing of the White House, which is usually reserved for the President and the President's immediate staff. She was appointed to head up the Task Force on National Health Care Reform and also helped to create the Office on Violence Against Women at the Department of Justice. She also initiated the Adoption and Safe Families Act, a piece of legislation which corrected problems with the foster care system. This bill was passed by Congress and signed into law by President Clinton in 1997. In 2000, as the Clintons were preparing to leave the White House, Hillary Clinton announced her intention to run for a seat in the United States Senate in New York. She won this election and was re-elected to the Senate in 2006. During her time in the Senate, she served on five different Senate committees, including the Armed Services Committee and the Budget Committee. Senator Clinton announced that she was running for president in 2008. During the 2008 Democratic primaries, she won 23 states, including victories in California, New York, Florida, Texas, and Ohio. However, she eventually lost the nomination to Barack Obama, who went on to win the general election as well. 
After his election, Obama announced that Hillary Clinton was his first choice to become Secretary of State. She accepted this position and was sworn in as Secretary of State on January 21, 2009. She became the first former First Lady to serve a cabinet-level position. During her time as Secretary of State, Clinton visited 112 countries, more than any other Secretary of State in history. While she was Secretary of State, she worked to build relationships with foreign nations and dealt with problematic situations in places such as Afghanistan, Egypt, and Libya, amongst many others. Following President Obama's re-election to the presidency in 2012, Clinton announced her resignation as Secretary of State, stating that she was not interested in a second term in the office. Politically, Clinton has not always been a Democrat. She was raised in a very conservative household and supported Republican candidate Barry Goldwater for president in 1964. During her college years, she was the president of the Wellesley Young Republicans and even attended the 1968 Republican National Convention. However, her political views began to change while in college, largely because of her opposition to the Vietnam conflict. By 1976, she had become a staunch Democrat, working as Jimmy Carter's campaign director in Indiana. Hillary Clinton announced that she was running for president on April 12, 2015. She faced strong opposition from rival Bernie Sanders during the 2016 Democratic primaries, but ultimately succeeded in securing her party's nomination. On July 28, 2016, Hillary Clinton accepted the Democrat nomination for president. With this nomination, she became the first woman to be the presidential nominee for either of the two main political parties in the United States.